If we start on the theater scene, how long would you be able to stay awake to win a free truck? How about 91 hours? That really happened <laughs> in Texas, Jamarcus. And it's the plot of a musical that just hit the stage in Spartanburg. And it's called Hands on a Hard Body. It's making a lot of people laugh. I saw it this weekend. Here's a look. Everybody's screaming for that hard body. The Spartanburg Little Theater is bringing a new Broadway hit to the stage based on a true story. Well, Hands on a Hard Body is a Broadway musical from 2013, and it was based on a documentary film made in 1997 about a contest in Longview, Texas, in East Texas, uh, to win a Nissan truck. It was like a promo for a Nissan dealership. And people had to stand around a truck with their hands on it, and the last person who survived, um, who kept their hand on it the entire time, won the truck. Believe it or not, the contest actually went on for 91 hours, making for some hilarious stage material. Many of the characters in the musical are actually characters from the documentary film, um, and much of the dialogue and a lot of the song lyrics are taken directly verbatim from what these people in the documentary said. You couldn't write the kind of things that these real people said. It's so funny. But they don't die that the show is also filled with music that jam band lovers will appreciate. There's a lot of gospel, a lot of country, a lot of rock, a blues. It was actually written, the music was actually written by the front man for this band called Fish, Trey Anastasio. Director Jay Kaufman says he's excited to be presenting something this fresh. To have something that's new and based on something that's real life is really special. Uh, and it was great for the actors to be able to grab on to characters that were actually real people. And some of the things that happen in this show are so ridiculous, audience members will find themselves hooked. You know, people start to hallucinate, um, people go numb, um, people play mind games with each other, uh, try to convince each other to drop their hands. Um, sometimes it happens by accident, but the real fun about it is watching the contest and not knowing who wins, and then everybody in the audience is sort of rooting for their own character to finish the contest and win the truck. First scene, I'm Jennifer Martin. It was really funny. It looks really funny. And the music was really great, yeah. too. So if you're interested in seeing that, Hands on a Hard Body is showing at the Chapman Cultural Center this Friday and Saturday at 8 p.m. and Sunday at 3. And just so you know, there is a little bit of, there's a little bit of language. Little so adult it's, language. I would say PG-13. But if you're interested, go to chapmanculturalcenter.org.